Hey, my name's Emmy Lou and this is the rocket drive that we built a couple weekends ago that we're going to, that we cooked the barbie on, a barbecue on. Yeah, and um, we're going, we just saw a video just then of a new design of the rocket stove and we're going to try that out and see if it actually works quicker. I'm going to pull this one apart very quickly. Now let's do this. So, uh, once we took it apart, then we just put it, um, a little plate down. Um, last time when we built our other, um, rocket, uh, stove, we used one of these to put it on top and the air would come in and the sticks would come here. But now we're going to do the air coming into this side and another, and then a sticks coming into here and yeah that's the new design we're gonna do so first we're going to do our base now we're going to try to aim for six bricks high because that is the minimum how many bricks so what we would do first we would put this down put this down and then put these across here and then we put one of our half bricks into this tiny little gap over here and then see here this is going to be the air part of the plat of the stove and then so then we're going to just do this now, if yours is a bit wobbly, see, because there's nothing under here, we can, don't worry, because we have a solution for that. We are easily just going to grab one of these bricks and place it on top of here to make that stable. And then, that's going to go over here. This part we're going to leave blank and just add a brick right across here. And then we're going to leave this part. And then we're going to put one up across here. And then we're going to put this there. And that is going to be where we feed our sticks. And then we just build all the way around here. There. And yeah. Then two more layers up across here and then our stove will be finished. Okay, so now we've finished our build. You can touch straight down. Yeah. And just telling you, remember uh, we've built six layers up because that is the one you have to do. And then what you do next is we will put a cup of these bricks, one against here. So we can 
rest sticks on. Yeah. And the side here, the air is going to go through here and sticks are going into here to create a fire. Okay, so with when you're cooking this, you can put some metal on top of here to make a base. Or, here's another, you can put two bricks on these sides to lay your pan on to cook. So what you would really need for your fire is just basic little twigs like these. You don't need too big of a stick. Okay, so we're going to do some paper to put in this air, air hole. Scrunch it up real tight and so it's all thick. And then we're just going to carefully stuff it in this air hole to put underneath. And then we're going to get a little bit of sticks right here and stuff them in here. And not too many to start with. And so you grab a match and we're going to stick it right where the paper is underneath it. It'll start smoking a bit, but then the fire will come on. You might have to blow on it gently to get the fire of it started. Once you know it's super smoking, um, the smoke will settle down and you'll have a fire. Put the crate on and the water on. And this will boil soon. So our fire has really gone shooting through and um, you can see the smoke has gone disappearing and because the fire, and if we lift this off you can easily see these flames are rising. I think we did a pretty good job building this fire today, cup of tea time I think. <laughs> Um, well, I hope you um, will try doing this at home and see if it works for you.